Hey guys, what's up? It's your boy the Super Kamikaze here, and in today's video, what I got for you is a double Moab fail. I died one off this thing from, from behind by some guy prone in his own spawn. But anyway, the gameplay is pretty irrelevant because Call of Duty Ghost is right around the corner. But anyway, hopefully, you, Lee, you enjoy the gameplay regardless and enjoy this lovely commentary. And so, basically, let's hop into it. It's it's a story from when I first moved to Canada. A pretty awkward story. So. Basically, it's the last period of school, it's English, and background history here, all English teachers have always hated me. And this one was an old woman, and it was the first day of school, basically, first week of school. I didn't know anyone, and I just asked the per ask her, could I have a rub rubber, please? Sorry for the hiccups. And I asked her for a rubber, and she's just like, gives me the strangest look, and I'm just like... I'm, d I'm still like weeded out and she's like excuse me I'm like can I have a rubber please and she's because in Australia a rubber is an eraser and a condom is a condom and but over here an eraser is an eraser and a rubber is a condom so I didn't know what I was saying wrong and she basically just looks at me like I will not accept this inappropriate behavior in my classroom and she, this is at the end of the day. She takes me down to the principal's office, and they, she tells him the story. Like they still haven't translated the, the terminology for me, so I have no idea what the fuck's going on. I'm just like flabbergasted. Just, what the fuck is going on? And they like ask me for my parents' number then, and I have I because we just moved here. I didn't know their numbers yet. I haven't memorized it, and I'm like I have no idea. I'm sorry. And they're like, don't lie to us. How stupid do you think we are? I'm like, I honestly don't know their numbers. They're like, how stupid do you think we? Are? I mean, how stupid are you for not knowing their numbers? I'm like, I, I don't know the numbers. I literally just moved here. And they're like, where's your phone? Get the numbers off your phone. And I'm like, I don't have a phone yet. We literally moved here like a week ago. And they still wouldn't believe me. And I don't know. Like, they couldn't even tell from my freaking accent that I just moved here. Like. I, I think they're, like, retarded. I don't know what was wrong with them. But, yeah, and they, like, threatened me detentions and everything. They're, like, giving me lectures, and I still have no idea what was going on. And they're just going off at me, telling me I'm perverted, and, like, I, I had no idea what was going on. I was just like, what the fuck is happening? And after, like, at, like, 5 o'clock when the school shuts down and everyone goes home, they decide to let me go. And it wasn't until the next day that I found out that I actually was asking for a condom, and I was like, oh, fuck my life. <laughs> and, yeah. So, yeah, that was my, that's my awkward story for this week. So, if you guys enjoyed the story and you're going to clock out early for the second moment, be sure to drop a like and subscribe if you're not already. But anyway, I'm going to leave you some E-double, because this second moment is absolutely animalistic. Peace, Super Kamikaze out. Animalistic with your instincts Walk around confident that your shit stinks Leave your mark on them And you can't be bargained with Shit's so butter but they selling you margarine Don't buy it, keep trying Save your strength for what you've been eyeing Both eyes open, patches ain't pirate Caribbean dreams are unseen but I digress Into the present tense, we all hesitant Ain't one of us heaven sent Emotions build up so you better vent Stick out like sore thumbs and that leather vest But even in that thing you are not an animal Even in hand in on the avenue Fanny pack looking like a kangaroo Whatever you need to keep up that mandible I change shapes just to hide in this place But I'm still, I'm still an animal Nobody knows it with me when I slip Yeah, I slip, I still an animal Ups and downs with the peaks and valleys I reach my palace and it's in the alley No cage, more like a jungle Thoughts run free but my ego's humble I wish everyone still could hope for The things they dreamed it could leave that dope for But I'm a realist and I'm revealing The things that cut me so fuck these feelings Come on, cut the reeling, it's time to cast again Blast off, mask off, fuck the oxygen Time continuing, my mind is asking When the pain will stop, we fade to black again Shades of grey, absolutes, no truth in them No line in the sand, I cruise to them That troll, that bridge, I'm used to them Pain, no toll, easy pass, never lose to them Price is long, I shop for deals No carry, cause Barker has got the wheel Long road, but we never gonna stop for meals we just hammer on like a clock and spiel Copper feel on the tits of life I just might relish the hate I taste It's like spice on my tongue My venom does not require spite Unlike thirst is quench without spray like that.
listen to that. Do whatever the fuck you want. Freestyle Friday 26, Facebook.com backslash EW Hip Hop. And we do this, and I do that, and you with this, and I'm with that. Uh, 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 ow, ow. Twitter.com backslash EW Hip Hop. Man, we do it like that, like fuck. Anyway, guys, I thought this song was a pretty accurate description of how it was during the game at the end. Turn people to shreds like an animal, and also at the end of the song, fuck exactly what I said when I died. But yeah, 75 kills in the game with specialists, so gun kills, 75 kills. Modern Warfare 3 isn't a kill horn in game, so pretty damn good. So be sure to drop a like for that and the double mod fail. And if you're not already, be sure to subscribe. Anyway, Super Kamikaze, signing out.